And tomorrow, I'm the biggest bear out there. There, there. So be it. You win some, you lose some. But you live to trade another day. Live to make another play. You win some, you lose some. But you live to trade another day. Live to make another play. Money don't make no money. Scared money don't make no money. Scared money don't make no money. Scared money don't make no money. You win some, you lose some. But you live to trade another day. Live to make another Is it the bottom yet? I'm trying to buy up everything. Not gonna get upset. Just pull the trigger, let it bang. When I see a trade, I'm hopping in like a Uber to secure my future up early, just like a rooster. Eyes glued to the computer, looking for a bag or two. Market cipher on the screen, compliments of trading view. Now I know what I'ma do: buy low and sell high. Even if you try and fail, at least you didn't fail to try. I don't wanna be the type of guy that let fear win. I'm the one that dive in head first and bust my chin. I know FOMO is a no-no, but I still get it in. Now I can't predict the future, but I know I'm bound to win. Later or sooner, I'll be the big kahuna. Cause I, cause I got big kahunas. I was not scared to get money. Y'all took me some chances and now I'm the big kahuna. And if you scared, might as well get neuter. I'ma keep chasing my dreams. Wake up and mansion so big. I need a segue to get from wing to wing. Scared money don't make no money. 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 You win some, you lose some. But you live to trade another. All right, guys. Welcome, welcome to the channel. Welcome to Dano Crypto. Hope you guys are feeling well. Guys, gals, aliens, and Dejan freaks. So we, last night, live on the stream, we surpassed 2,000 subscribers, guys. So it's a, a awesome milestone for the channel. Thank you. What's going on, Brucey? Shout out to Brucey. What's going on? So we are, we are going through a little bit of volatility here. Uh, we have we we have uh, Bitcoin taking some of the lows. We got some liquidity grabs happening. It looks like, and so could we be getting a bounce from these lows, or are we going to go into the sixty-seven thousand range, the sixty-six thousand dollar range? I mean, what is going to happen with Bitcoin in the short term here, or are we going to have a mega bounce? Because we're coming off this bull flag. We'll show you guys. We showed you last night. We actually went short this morning a little bit. We kind of we had some of our trades get stop lossed, and uh, and so we went entered back into the market. So we are going to we're gonna get into it. We're gonna get into the get into the trades. We're gonna get into what we're doing right now, and I just want to say thank you guys so much to. All the new subscribers, all the all the support, I really do appreciate it. It really means a lot. Uh, going on this crypto journey and um, doing these live streams every day and making content, trying to give more value and get better, show you my mistakes, show you my 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 success, and uh, show you uh, just how how to get into crypto. So I hope you guys are feeling well. So let's see how many people we have watching across all platforms. We got six people on YouTube. We got three on X and we got one on Twitch. So the Twitch people came out the woodwork uh, last night. It was so amazing. We had the Twitch viewers coming out and say and asking questions and getting into crypto. We know the Twitch people are, are mega gamers, but we know that uh, crypto and gaming kind of go hand in hand now. So thank you. Shout out to the Twitch. Shout out to the Twitch people. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at our trades here. And, you know, we did. We went short and we we could have stayed short for a little bit longer because we did push. We did take some lows. So if you're looking at the charts and this is just for Pepe, you know, Pepe just kind of took the lows here and uh, basically wicked down to the support level. And now we're seeing that Look, we got two green candles. We got a doji candle here and two green candles to support the price going back up to um, maybe uh, take take the highs. 
in these volume area um, volume area highs here, right here. So if you were to be able to, sh so I, I went short, closed them out because I saw BTC uh, obviously bouncing off of these levels because we see a strong wick of a bounce. And we just have to see if we can get a flip reversal um, because we were projecting going into 72,000. And sometimes these, these, these bull pennants sometimes will play out going a little bit longer than expected and then just shoot because this is an example right here on the me token where we had a a consolidation off of a off of a pump this pole here and then we consolidated consolidated for you know from let's see from the high as you say we consolidated for a good 27 days until we hit the next breakout so you know you could you could speculate with pop probability that in the next you know 19 uh, you know, between, you know, 17, 20 days that will consolidate in this price with me and then maybe continue to do the next leg up, especially when BTC is, you know, it's still on an uptrend. You know, all we did is we just go, went back below the trend line. And if you're looking at the smaller time frames, you can see that we could be just pushing right back up to test the trend. And this was just a liquidity grab to get the lows and uh, basically, uh, you know, liquid, the market short got liquidated, shorts got liquidated pretty hard yesterday. And then this was probably like a little, little fight back for the, for the bears. And now let's see what's happening, you know, with the altcoins, you know, the altcoins, if you go to danielcurtishughes.com, uh, let's go here and go to, let's go to the page. And looking at the crypto bubbles, we have Toncoin has been doing really, really well. So we've talked about Toncoin. We know that it's the Telegram chain. It's got the biggest user base, Telegram. So we could speculate that Ton could could take over the top 10 in terms of market cap. You go to market cap and it's I think it's in the top 10. Yeah. <clears throat> Is there still music playing? I don't know. Is there music playing right now? I don't think so. It's just my voice. Does my voice sound like music? <laughs> Are you just meaning in general? You're just meaning in general. <laughs> That's funny. No, but I, I know some people some people do not like the music. They think it's distracting whether it doesn't matter what music what music you have, but uh we'll be building a, a, a true uh playlist that has a good selection of beats and things like that. Cause a lot of times I just put on, you know, a playlist that's royalty free. And then even then I try I try my best, but then it gets it gets copyrighted, it gets hit with copyrights constantly. Um, so we'll be, we'll be making a curated beat list because I have my own, my own copyrighted music that I can use myself that I make. So we'll probably end up just doing that because then we'll be a full one man show. But thank you guys so much for popping into the discord. The discord is, is finally getting some traction. It's getting some activity. Uh, you're more than welcome to come in and just hang out and chat, chat amongst yourselves, post some funny memes, please. Like let's get the memes going and also, you can show your trade setups. Um, this is what this is what I uh, was telling you what happened with me this morning, just to tell you kind of what my moves were. And um, oh yeah, you started it right from the beginning. Okay, yeah. So it was just like it was pumping super loud. Yeah, I was I was pumping that song for a reason. I love that song. But um, but yeah. So come in here and just um, make yourself make yourself known to the Dano Crypto Dojo community and just read through the the welcome and rules. I love this section. That's pretty funny. But yeah, thank you to all the new members. Welcome to the new members. I think now we have a total of we have 50 members now. We have 50 people in the Discord, so that's awesome. All right. So let's see <clears throat> how just the overall market is doing on coin market cap.
And shout out to you guys who are in the live stream. Thank you so much for being here. We started a little late. I've been tr I was trying to uh, put together this pool, so I was trying to do a few things and get it done, get get some food in me, and I think uh, we managed to get the stream going. Hamad the Trader is here from Jason Casper's YouTube channel. Amazing. Yeah, the Casper crew. The Casper crew is awesome. It's one of the, I think, one of the uh, the best crews in the crypto space. You know, you guys got a great sense of humor, and that, that that's all you need in this space is just a great sense of humor and, a, you know, a good work ethic and you know, you just you got it. You got to get active in the in the markets and and just at least test out trading. And so that's what I'm doing. You know, I could have just been a spot guy where I just you know spot buy crypto and hold and just you know talk about it. And <laughs> but I wanted to test out doing multiple, you know, multiple things, multiple strategies. So it's 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 helped. You know, it's obviously you know I I I have you know there's always risks risk with anything, but I think if you don't experience it and take it then <clears throat> i don't know so but welcome all right so we're gonna get we're gonna get we're gonna get some things going here all right <clears throat> So let's look at the trades now. Let's see what's happening with Bitcoin because we didn't take any profits on our Bitcoin long that we have here on Femex. And we were up 50%. We could have taken taken profits and obviously bought back in right here. But we just, we're just super bullish right now. And, it, and, it, and maybe it might bite us in, in getting more of an, an exposure in this long to get a little bit more margin in because you know we could we could have taken profits and then put a little bit more margin to beat this thing up to about a thousand dollars in bitcoin so then when we see the breakout we'll start pulling about 1000 1500 or 2k on this particular bitcoin long but it just for me it just seemed like just bitcoin was just really just taking trying to take the lows here like a liquidity grab and to scoop up a little bit uh, cheaper prices before really going into the halving, and then we just blast off. So I'm I'm feeling that. I'm feeling that. You know, we could be getting a reversal. We could be getting the bounce right now. I was seeing this 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 right here was a nice pattern to show a breakout coming up right here to go into this flag. And then this, 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 if, you, if I was watching the charts and I think I was up until like 2 a.m. and I just kind of let my trades start going and, and just let them ride. And when I woke up, <clears throat> a, a few of them were stop lost, which is great because then I was able to preserve some of the capital and get back into the market and so, but see, this is why I think the the alts and the BTC price is kind of showing a a reversal or or it's showing a bounce to go back into the trend line because we were just we were just trying to we were just catching these lows. So I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the chat if you took advantage of of, of a short. Possibly, I was not quick enough. I tried to short. I I shorted and I I I closed my shorts and little little profits and. You can see, let me see the order history here. Um, let's see. Yeah, see right here, profit and then profit. And then you see where, where some of them were stop lost, closed. And then we did, we, we did get liquidated on the ZK trade, which was, which was, um, we, we should have just put a damn stop loss in that thing, but we were thinking it was going to hit that three cents, but it, it didn't have a chance, especially with the Bitcoin volatility. So, but it is what it is. You win some, you lose some, but you live to trade another day. <clears throat> all right. So let's see how many people we have watching right now across all platforms. We are building up this channel. We're building up the live stream. Thank you guys for doing the, the PR for me. Everyone's been super nice and sharing it on different platforms. And that just really helps out and gets the gets the action going and just to remind you guys if you want to become a member you can post 
these amazing oh and we only have two likes and we got 12 people watching so we got to get the likes up so as many people as as are watching this stream we need to hit the like button because then that gets me more excited we get more people in here we get more pumping yes <laughs> so let's see i think we're gonna get that bounce we're gonna get that bounce we're gonna get that bounce Would have been nice to short it just a little bit longer. I closed the shorts a little too, a little too early. Let me know what you're drinking, guys. <clears throat> this, I'm drinking a, I'm drinking a yerba mate. I haven't had one of these in a while, but this one's really good. This is a cranberry pomegranate. But we're, I think we're gonna make we're gonna make some money, guys. We're gonna get back. We're gonna get back some of these losses. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I at least took I took them in profit, but it was it was I had more of a chance to ride them down a little bit. But as you can see here, this is where I was like, okay, right here. But as you can see on the MACD, I mean, if you're gonna look at the MACD, you could you could you could say that the selling is getting a little bit exhausted because it's fading out right here and. We're about to cross here, but this is on the 15 minute. <clears throat> so we can look at the four hour and then that maybe give us a, that gives us a little bit of a different story. We're going to need, yeah. So, but this is starting to, cause it, in the, if a, you know, learning about the MACD, you'll understand Oh, water with apple cider. Yeah. I actually, I have, I have, uh, the Braggs. Uh, it's the Concord grape apple cider vinegar drinks. Like those things are amazing. I, I love that brand. Like all their, all their drinks and products are amazing. And yeah, just doing shots of apple cider vinegar with honey and cinnamon and stuff like that is really good for you. It's a good cleanse. But yeah, we'll see what happens with these trades. I feel like we are getting a bounce. I keep saying this. Just so, just so Bitcoin will just will will do a true bounce. <laughs> so this is good sign. We had two, we had two, uh, two, three red candles, but two of these you can see have two major wicks on them, and then we have to uh, break this level, the sixty nine, the sixty nine seven. And if we get two can, if we get a couple candles going up, but if we if we start breaking down again, then we could very well start breaking down to 68 that could very well happen and and in that case we still might keep this we'll still keep this trade open but we had an opportunity to take it at at 150 dollars in profit but we were just we were we were bullish we we're too bullish sometimes it's okay it's okay. What's going on, Crypto Fart? Said, hey, Dano, wanted to head in to work soon, but wanted to drop in and say hello, drop you a like. Thanks, man. Thanks, sir. I appreciate it. That's awesome. I love people just kind of just popping in. Even if they can't stay long, they pop in to say hello and drop a like. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Shout out to Crypto Fart. The the I had told my daughter, I was like, Crypto Fart, and she she always laughs. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what's happening <clears throat> in the news. Ada out of the top 10 Cardano community optimistic for future growth. A Binance Quest quest for crypto friendly HQ. Bitcoin Layer 2 Network Mizo raises 21 million. Okay, what is it? Mizo? We gotta check out Mizo. Alright, so let it because like we're into the we're into stacks. We're into the layer twos. We like Thor chain. Let's see, Mizo um developed by Thesis has emerged from stealth with 21 million series of if A round funding led by Pantera Capital. This innovative platform aims to create a permissionless Bitcoin economic layer offering a wide range of applications through a neutral smart contract infrastructure. Mizo introduces the proof of hold program. 
allowing users to earn yield on their idle Bitcoin holdings. Oh, damn. That's cool. The funding round also saw participation from notable investors such as uh, Multicoin Capital, HackVC, and others. That's pretty dope. All right, so <clears throat> let's check this out. Okay. Thesis. Mezo. Okay, so let's see if Mezo is listed on. <clears throat> ah. Mezo, no. Mezo means you can hold your BTC with purpose, power in the Bitcoin economy, replacing vital online infrastructure and unlocking the full potential of your BTC. Hmm. <clears throat> Our goal with Mezo is to extend the Bitcoin network to bring 25% of the world's economy on chain, roughly in line with the size of the US economy today. All right, so. Interesting. All right, we're gonna keep we're gonna keep our eye on that. Mezo. What else do we have going? Meta Planet soars 90% with Bitcoin strategy. So is this another company that's doing a, same, a similar thing like MicroStrategy? Asia's first MicroStrategy. Yeah. Okay. See, when companies start doing this, they're going to implement the Bitcoin strategy. They're going to realize that, you know, it's going to greatly affect their overall balance sheet, even if their actual company itself isn't, <laughs> isn't doing very well, which is very interesting. Arrow. Um, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll see. I'll see about it. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. If you guys, if you guys can do me a favor, if you are, um, if you haven't followed me yet on X, it's at DanoCrypto904. It's a lot of the times where I'm going to post something quick and uh, let you guys know about a certain project or anything that I'm doing. I'll, I'll post it here first. And I would appreciate if you repost, repost the stream start getting more traction on X and we'll check out we'll check out this product let's see the let's see the charts here let's see what's happening with the alts hopefully we're gonna get a bounce we want to bounce because eventually if these start getting into into bad territory we're gonna end up closing them so we can preserve some of the some of that capital we do not want to be losing any more capital today Yeah, it looks like we are getting, we are not getting the bounce that we, that we were wanting. We did not push. We, we did not break the sixth, this, this level right here. It's not looking good, but can the bulls pull in and start pushing liquidity in? Or are we wanting to, or are they, or are some, or is someone wanting lower prices? Big, big volume node right here at 67. We could be going down to 67, guys. It, yeah, we could be going to 67. This is on the one hour. And if we, if we really, if we look at this chart right here, we could be, we could very well be pushing, uh, pushing, pushing the lows right here to six to 67,800. Which could line up with this with this particular Bitcoin article, if we go to the news. Twenty K crash. This crypto founder, this is uh, Arthur Hayes, was saying that we could be coming in a Bitcoin fire sale right now. Is this happening right now as we speak? We might actually close this trade in profit, so then we can solidify some of this profit. Because if we go down to sixty seven, that is going to uh, B, way below. That's going to be below our entry price, which means we could get a lower entry price. It looks like it, and so this means we could be, 
in some trouble here <clears throat> with our with our altcoin trades. Yeah, we might we might want to close these because we don't want to risk any more losses on these. And we could flip them we could flip them short. Because we're going to see that same rejection on these on these particular coins as well as we see this Bitcoin dip. 100% Because the volume, the volume just left. There's way more sell pressure. Yeah, it's just like, look, this point of control is just wanting to smack right into 67. So we're gonna go ahead. I think we're gonna we're gonna close this particular trade, so we can at least solidify some profits right here, and we'll just do it at last and. Oh, I think we need to do this here. We'll do it here, hundred percent at the last price. Okay. All right, so we close that <clears throat> we close that in profit. It would have been nice to close it in a little bit more profit. But if we're going if we're if the charts are are showing what showing what it's showing, we could be pushing the lows. Well, leverage, I think I was watching a video, Jason Casper explained leverage and, and what it is, is it, do, I don't think it matters necessarily what leverage you use. It's just, if you have confirmation of, you know, you have at least two, three different confirmations that are showing you that the trend is going up or the trend is going down then that so that the leverage doesn't matter so i i you know 10x 15x you know i think it's just how much money how much margin do you have so if you only have 20 bucks or you only have 25 bucks then maybe higher margin and you close the trade earlier you use more margin use less leverage you have an opportunity to keep the trade open longer so it's you can swing trade a lot longer with low leverage with between five and 10 X leverage. And that gives you an opportunity to, um, it gives you an opportunity to, um, either be long, be either be have a longer time frame in your trade or a shorter time frame in your trade. And that's what I've noticed with using bigger leverage is I've had smaller margin with big leverage, big margin with lower leverage. And that's what I'm trying to do as my as my particular strategy. <clears throat> All right, so yeah, it looks like we are getting we are getting we are not getting the bounce. We're getting more of a we're getting more of a rejection a more of a rejection if we're looking at these time frames. Thirty minute.
Oh, I don't have that. Oh, man, I got to upgrade my trading view. All right, guys, should I should I short? Should I short right now and take and take the lows into into the level? Or am I getting too spooked? <laughs> Could be very well that we get we get we're getting a little spooked, but it does look like we're drawn down that we could draw down. Because we are we're just we're due for for we're due for this for this bounce. We're due for this bounce, but we just lost a little bit of the money flow. But we're gonna have to we're gonna have to see. We're gonna have to see in these shorter time frames. Cause it could very well be that we just we we're already below the band. So we could just go right and just go right into this level right here, 67. And there's a lot of bearish news as Bitcoin headed for a crash. Analysts cite possible downtrend. Yep. <clears throat> Just wonder how it's gonna how these how these particular altcoin trades are going to react because they might react very spicy. And then we need to get out of these, secure the capital. And then possibly instead of just shorting, we'll just wait until we hit our levels to be able to go long, and then we'll decide between between these how much we want to put in for for margin because at this point we'll if we close them out right now we'll be we'll be down we'll be down just a little bit yeah bitcoin's definitely doing doing the thing it's doing the thing Yeah, we could yeah, so we could we could short right to probably the bottom of this band. Or or into this support into the support right here because we have support at 68,000. Oh, nice! Heaven Peck's been crushing it on Solana. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta follow. Uh, I gotta follow a little bit of what you're doing, Heaven Peck. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, Heaven Peck's been heavy in heavy in Solana. Yep, we're seeing definitely we're seeing some short action here. Thanks. A shout out to Heaven Pexen and a super sticker. <laughs> Amazing. Love it. All right. So we have, uh, oh, I didn't even realize, man, we got 27 people in the live stream. Thank you guys so much for being here. So if you haven't hit the like button yet, please do so. We're live trading. We're going to show you, um, we're going to show you what we're doing. We're showing you that look, BTC is getting the reversal. We we could probably just go. I see a level right here that could be an e, uh, an obvious target that Bitcoin wants to go to, sixty eight thousand two hundred and eighty five. Maybe we put in a short. Let's see. We don't have hedge mode on here. I don't think it lets you do hedge mode hedge mode on a coin perpetual. We'll see. So we'll go last price, and we'll see if we get this short order filled and it is filled all right so we will set an alert 
We got 68443. 68443. It just, yeah, it looks like it, it's easy to test this band, to test the Bollinger Band dip here, this zoop, this little swoop here. But yeah, that's all. Yeah, that's awesome. So, I kind of Solana's just kind of been scaring me a little bit because I I I don't want to start throwing a bunch of money and then I and then I can't use it. It's scary. Network congestion, different things. It's like okay, I I guess Jupiter is the play. <laughs> yeah, it's good. So when you start, if you can if you can catch the the trend in a in a particular ecosystem like Solana then you can definitely double up because Solana's just had such a big run. So a lot of people that bought Solana early, early, they were already high up on Solana. So then they switched it up and they were like, okay, I got the Jupiter airdrop. Then they went, then they either sold half of the jupe or kept or, or sold all the jupe and then went into, um, went into, you know, all the other different meme coins and shout out to Ross Davey saying congrats on 2k subs. <laughs> Every time I turn up, the channel is bigger. Yes, that's the goal. That's the goal. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to build the channel, but it's honestly, it's been from the help of you guys. I mean, you guys have been sharing the channel and and um, just just doing amazing on the on the PR. So I really appreciate it. Yeah, this is a, a great level that we can look for. Is sixty seven is sixty seven k, but let's see how the these trades are reacting because the altcoin trades are probably going to react a little bit. I don't like how my browser my browser is is running super slow so we uh the trades are, are <laughs> it's it's not loading as fast as I need it to it's freaking me out a little bit we might just need to close a couple we need to close a couple uh close a couple browsers so um we talked about XYO is releasing an operating system to help engage with their dApps, or if you have a dApp that's running on XYO, you can have an operating system for it. So super cool. It's pretty bullish news for XYO because it's a cool decentralized way that you can interact with your own program using the XYO ecosystem. All right. Okay, so... What's great is that we were in profit. We took this in profit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Dave. Okay, so da Davey wins. Is uh, you were the you were were you the one that went into the ZK the ZK trade with me? <laughs> yeah, I hope I I hope your trade did not get absolutely wrecked because because mine did mine did I did not protect it protect it enough. So I hope you put a stop loss in. I hope you put a stop loss in and I also hope you then immediately went short and counter reversed inversed uh <laughs> inversed it. <laughs> Perfect to put on that song you win some you lose some but you live to trade another day. All right, so <laughs> okay cool all right all right we survived we survived okay so what i love looking at i love doing the moon boy math on my btc trade for that i got in an average price of thirty four thousand dollars the liquidation price is at 33,000. So I don't see Bitcoin going anywhere near those prices. So people have been thinking, okay, what's the, what number do you think Bitcoin is going to go to in the, in the end, end of year? I want to know in the chat, what is your price prediction for the end of the year for Bitcoin? Just start spamming the chat. I want to know, what do you think is the highest that Bitcoin is going to go after the having post having because we're going to have major volatility obviously going into the having because it's in eight days so what do you guys think we're going to be going into okay we got 120k 
100 K ish. We got 40 K a 40 K real Mike bearish going to zero. <laughs> All right, come on. Let me let me see some more. Two eight. Okay, yes, that's what I like to see. Heaven Peck saying two eighty. I like that. That's super bullish. That's where I'm at. I'm I'm at honestly. Uh oh my god. Real Mike said once the nuke drops forty k. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's say it goes to two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. So. This trade will still be netting profits of over three thousand, close to three thousand dollars. So this is why, if you can get a good swing trade long, then you can you can scalp profits off of this thing. Use it for multiplying your account up, using for DCA in. So that's exactly what I've been doing on this particular trade. And then you can see here on this particular BTC trade. You know, we have we have been just basically been scalping the BTC off to uh, get just to get more BTC. So funding fees haven't been too much, you know, like we haven't paid very much in funding fees, but it's been well worth it to be able to get just more exposure in the market. All right. So did are we getting now a reversal? I'm tell I told you guys there's going to be a lot of there there B Bitcoin is being very fake fake out where you it's like I knew it was taking the lows here but the way I was looking at the charts I was seeing I was seeing uh, a, a more low liquidity liquidity grab at 68,000 68.3 but now it looks like we're getting we're getting volume in and is it is it flipping is it is this is this where we're gonna bounce is this the bounce level or do we just get faked or do we just get faked out again because this is where I'm looking I'm looking at this level right here Basically, the, the bottom of the flag here of where we broke out initially. Because you can see here, this is like, you look here, this is the level here. So. Mm, yep, and then the money flow kind of started to go. We could, yeah, we just could be just seeing a little bit more of a sell-off. <laughs> yeah i don't even know if i want yeah let's look at it let's look at zk let's look at zk i mean i didn't put a. I i only put 33 bucks in it i mean i did it but it but yes it is it is sitting it is sitting at some at some support <laughs> it is sitting at some support But yeah, basically what happened because this was basically kind of like a symmetrical kind of a uh, triangle here. It was it was either up or down. I mean, you kind of market cap seven mil. It's not being traded, but radium they just posted the whiff hat for sale on the Phantom Wallet yesterday, and some whale, some whale. Uh, it was your, your chat was a little longer. Hold on. Okay. Yeah. I've been, I've been, I've been very, uh, curious about the, about the, about that. And I've been thinking you're saying it's just sold off. So you're, you're saying, you know, potential of getting into a long you're saying. Ooh, yeah. So yeah, ZK actually ZK does look good, but man, do I, <laughs> Okay. Oh man. All right. So now, okay. So yeah, we are actually getting the bounce. So we, okay. So that was the bounce. This, that, that might've been the actual bounce because we're starting to get more, we're starting to get money flow back in. And if we're looking on the 45 minute, we're getting, we're getting a bounce. 
All right, we're getting a bounce. But it's still so it's still so fake Audi. Fake Audi. All right, let's, let's let's still keep up with the markets. Let's keep up with it. Let me know, guys. Do you think I'm still uh, validated with uh, the potential of us going to scoop this scoop these lows right here with 68.4, 68.3? All right, so someone's asked me to check out. Aerodrome. 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 All right, we'll check it out on Coinbase. So it's on. Oh man. Okay. So on the 45, we just uh, recently saw a massive, uh, massive move here. 41 percent. Looks like it still wants to go. And cup and handle. Two, two seventeen could be the target. Two eighteen. Have to break the resistance on two dollars. It's already had a, a massive run, so it's going to naturally have a bit of a consolidation and a sell-off. And then $1.69 would be the, would be the, would be the support level. There you go. Aerodrome, Aerodrome Finance on Coinbase. Okay, so it's on Coinbase. All right, shout out to all the people that have been in the live stream. I do appreciate it, man. We're like breaking records on the live stream. We have 25 people overall on YouTube and we got 19 likes. So if you're watching on the TV, hit up, up, right, 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 select or up, up, right, right, select. And that will get the like button smashed on the TV. Might cause an electric shock. Just be careful. And just so you guys know, we do, we do on the channel. Thank you so much for helping me get to past 2K subscribers. We're going to just start crushing it up. I'd love to just start get like just killing it. Just getting up to three. Like I, cause getting to 2K was, was tough. It was tough. I mean, if I will, I'm just going to be completely honest. I mean, if it wasn't for like people giving me the shout outs and, and just, uh, you know, just being super awesome, super gracious, and giving me the opportunities. I mean, this channel would would still be just, uh, you know, but but it really helps to to have that support. So I'm I'm super grateful. Thank you so much to all the crypto peeps out there. It is. It's like entering an NES cheat code. You got to go up, up, or like a Mortal Kombat combo. Do, 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 do. Let's see if that helped, because I know there's some people watching on the TV. I know. All right, cool, cool, cool. 
Awesome. Just remember, buff SpongeBob. Buff SpongeBob says, hit the like button. <laughs> Guys, I don't know if you are, uh, if you are ever Pokemon fans. At any point. You see the Pokeball in the corner? All right, so is it actually now pulling back? Okay, yeah. I th see, it's so it's such a fake out. See, these candles are sneaky because it'll just make you think like, oh, should I get out of this trade? Should I, because I, look, if you look at the Bollinger Bands, this little scoop right here is telling us that this is the potential of it going back down to this line because it's not cro look at the cross it crossed right here the moving average is crossed right here so we could be just pushing to go down right into that level scooping into that la level oh you just asked me about a dragon coin and i just pulled out a dragonite hold on did that just happen did that really just happen Hold on, Contra? You said Contra? Is that the coin you were talking about? Or is this called Dragon? Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's go to... Let's go to the... It's on Solana. Dragon? Oh, Puff the Dragon. Okay, so let's see. Something like this would d definitely do well. Okay, so what is it on? On mantle, is this mantle? I have not used. I haven't used mantle. Okay, so puff the liquidity, sixteen million twenty cents. Oh, nice, and it's forming, it's forming a bit of a, it's forming a flag here. I've been seeing these pennants like, like crazy, where you just kind of you see the consolidation, and as long. As you see some retests and, and some and some support, then you can just have that similar move going back up to test up to the top of the range, which would be 24 cents on this particular one. But this is on the two hour. Look at the so puff. How long has it been out? It did it did it just did it just launch? Let's see in March March 9th. So just kind of looks it, it's a it's a bullish chart. It's definitely a bullish chart, but look, you can see, bam, we got a $27,000 sell-off right here with the whale. $27,000, that's, that's a chunk of change. We got ten, it's over 10,000 holders. So I've never used Mantle. So Mantle, is this a layer two? Is this Mantle, or is Mantle a... Uh, yeah, it's, I think it's a layer two, right? It looks like it. MNT. So, Mantle. I migrated to on Mantle for more. Uh, so, oh, BitDAO. Okay, and then dude, there's an Ethereum. Ethereum contract. All right, is a layer two technology stack for scaling Ethereum, first core product of Mantle ecosystem, Mantle network tries to be compatible with it. Okay, oh, okay, yeah, so, um, yeah, let's go, let's, let's add this thing. Um, all right, so where, I wanna add this to my wallet so then I can, so I can start getting into it. Oh, we got, we got the Twitch, we got the Twitch peeps in the house. I missed the comment. What did it say? I missed the comment. Hey, sorry for bothering you. I want to offer. Oh, hold on. What did what did it say? I missed it. Let me go to the let me go to the chat. Um, 
Want to offer a promotion to your channel viewers, followers, views, chatbots? The price is lower than any competitor. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, well, no, I'm kind of a one-man show. Kind of a one-man show, but I do, I do appreciate it, though. <laughs> I do appreciate it. All right, so let's let's keep looking at mantle. Let's keep looking at mantle. Uh, let's see, Br you can bridge to mantle, build on mantle. Got mantle E. The main net bridge, test bridge. All right, let's see the main net bridge. And then connect wallet, MetaMask, and then we'll add the network. We'll see what the RPC is. Connect. Okay, so we got the bridge. All right, yeah, I'll have to bust in. I'll yeah, I'll go more into this. I'll go into more into mantle. I'm just kind of just checking it out. All right. Let's see. All right, so we're in profit on this long. Or, I mean, on this short, so because we're going to short it to 68, we're going to catch the lows, then we're going to re enter back in with more margin. you guys read Richard's Hart recent post about his lawsuit but you can go in and read the full uh, doc document really interesting yeah Mesa we'll have to check out this Mesa a lot of Bitcoin layer 2 stuff is getting some traction. Have to check, check on these, check on these, on these trades here, because we might be getting into some risky territory now. Is everything? Yeah, because look, BTC is wanting to do a nice little dumpage, some dumpage. It's got some dumpage going on. Close some windows. Close some windows. We're getting, we're getting, got too much going on. Just a reminder, guys. We welcome all people in the Discord. We welcome all people in the Discord. Make sure you make yourselves known. Join. I'm <laughs> all right well all right well let's do it maybe maybe we'll have you maybe we'll have you on the channel we'll have a special heaven peck section where we will we'll get you on and we'll we'll explore and we'll do a solana meet we'll do a solana trading session what we'll do is we'll pull we'll start with one soul we'll start with one soul and we'll see how far we can get one soul we'll do that we'll do that as a challenge i think that would be fun we'll do it as a channel challenge we'll say We'll take the Heaven Peck challenge and see if we can turn one soul into however many soul. We'll so we'll make a goal. We'll say we'll take we'll take one soul and turn it into into ten soul. We could do it. We could do it. All right. So Bitcoin's doing exactly as predicted. Exactly. But we might be get we need to we need to get out of these uh, out of these positions. 
we need to get out of these positions because we are kind of hemorrhaging a little bit now on these particular ones. So we are going to, we're going to close them. We're going to close them. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's exactly what I'm doing, bro. And we're going to succeed. All right, so let's, uh, yeah, STG. Let's just, uh, we might just go straight into reversing, reversing the trade and just going straight into the short. But we might not have enough uh, as insufficient balance on Pepe. We'll see. Might be trying to take those same exact lows. We're getting major, we're getting some major lag. All right. All right. Major, major lag. That's okay. All right, so let's see if we can, let's see if we can reverse this one. Alright, so we managed to re flip reverse that one. So we're gonna try and ride the ride the short on that. And then we are going to get out of the long on Doge. And we'll try and ride the lows down. Do the same thing. So we don't lose any more. <laughs> uh, okay we didn't get we didn't get our order was not placed okay so now so we're gonna have to keep our eye on we're gonna have to keep our eye on bitcoin keep our eye on bitcoin because that's gonna be the telling if we start getting if we start if we break we break 69 if we break 697 then then that is that's going to be the the up but we we test 68 then that means we are we're going to be possibly even going low as a 683 i would really love for my my stuff to all right so Let's see what's happening on Solana. Since we were on the subject of Solana. What's got the most volume right now? Candle. Mitchie. Mamani. Duck. Baby Slurf. Ansom. 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 Rock two. But see, you can see some of these, you know, it's just like, how do you even? The market could just be be so fake faked out right now. But when we start crossing into these bands here,
This is what I'm looking for. But if we get invalidated, we, we will we will flip bullish and ride the wave, ride the trend. We will we'll dive into mantle. We'll check out mantle. We're gonna get we're gonna we're gonna test out heaven peck, a heaven peck challenge of turning one soul into ten soul. And what was the what was the dragon coin? It was the it was just it was puff, but that was on mantle. But then what was the what was the other one? You mentioned it. You mentioned it in the chat. Oh, con you said contra. Like contra. Contract. No, it wasn't that. Oh, the ZK Long, the ZK Long got 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 liquidated <laughs> for like for sure. So that did not that did not play out. But it looks like our shorts are it looks like our shorts are, are gonna do well though. And we're missing the opportunity right now on Doge to go to keep going short on Doge and ride the lows just like we were. We are right now with Pepe. And our browser is being an asshole. <laughs> or our computer is, essentially. Okay. So we are going to go short. Okay, so... We're still watching Bitcoin. We're going to watch Bitcoin. We're 16. We're in profit. We're, we're catching those lows right now. Thank you to all the people, all the viewers in the in the stream. I really do appreciate it. We're just like breaking records right now. We're getting like, we got 21 people in the YouTube. We got 15 people on X. We got one person on Twitch. So, I mean, we're just, we're breaking records right now. So I really do appreciate it, guys. This is really awesome. It really, it really means a lot to like start off my first week and journey of being full-time crypto and everyone's been just super nice and supportive and that's all I could ask for. So thank you. God bless every single one of you. Thank you very much. All right. Waving hi to the new peeps that are popping into the Discord. Like I said, we have uh, we have over 50 people in the Discord. Thank you to all the new members. Yeah, God bless anyone who is uh, getting put under the put under the fire or put under the the claws of the media. That's for sure. Anyone who has to go through go through that that battle. God bless them, because the media is the media and the institutions are brutal. They're brutal. They have no mercy. <laughs> All right, if you haven't followed me yet on X.com at DanoCrypto904. And the Discord link, if you go to if you go to my channel and let's see exactly. All right, so if you go to my channel, we'll go here. And if you go into the top of the description of the page, the Discord link is right here. So this is a full active Discord link. It never expires. So if you click this one and then also link to my website and then the Twitter, uh, my music page, and then also um, our partner and affiliate uh, Bitflex, uh, you sign up with that link and they're adding a bunch of new coins and we're going to start building up that portfolio and building up the spot on there and also uh, getting more flex points. 
Yeah, I think we're we're definitely gonna get this bottom. We're gonna get this bottom uh right. I think the I think it's gonna be established at I mean, look, it's gonna be get us if you follow the Bollinger bands, you can say, okay, look, it crossed here, moving averages are gonna start swooping to meet and catch these these lows right here. And then it's gonna do the same thing with these with these altcoins, and then we'll try and scoop some profits off re-enter back into the market and then we we will then ultimately oh and then ftm uh yeah phantom we love phantom uh we love phantom on this channel uh oh man yeah phantom phantom is oh man we weren't watching phantom so yes phantom is actually doing very well i mean look it's just like doing doing awesome Maybe maybe we get into maybe we get into phantom right now because phantom probably a lot of the liquidity might be pushing into phantom we got high look high liquidity right even on the 15 minute and the the 2 hour looks really good because it looks like it wants to push liquidity up to this dollar 23 level yeah that's looking that's looking juicy yeah phantom is actually looking really good phantom is looking awesome yeah let's see yeah yeah, high probability that we end up that we end up going to that 68, that 684 level and then we will see about taking the profits and then go back in long on this particular trade and then these we don't touch, you know, we're fine. We're fine with these. But we'll see. We'll see how see how these alts are all alts are reacting. The fact that Phantom is reacting that way could be that People are taking profits and and actually running them into things like Pepe and Doge, which could actually be um, not a good uh, not a good short position where you would actually want to be going long. So, but we'll see. We will see. This is on Doge. This is Doge. So we would be taking we would be taking the highest volume area nodes right here where we have the mo most blue, which would be the lowest would be right here. Yeah. Yeah. You, you could, you could say that because then there is more potential for it for downside. And then you could miss the opportunity of getting in, in a better limit price or limit order. You're very, you're very, you're very right. Yeah, so we will see. We'll see what happens. We don't want to jump. We don't want to jump around too much because a lot of the times we could just let these things, let these things play out, uh, decrease the leverage a little bit, and then get a little bit more, a little bit more margin um, in the trade, and then just play it, play it from there. Because we don't want to be. We don't want to be short while the market is bullish and starting to go back into an uptrend. Because all it'll take is a couple of different green candles to push us back up to 69, get a bounce to 69, and then we start, we start pushing back up to 70. But... We could very well get a uh some type of some type of rejection seven eight six and then we will see we will see but man phantom looking nice it's looking really good. We just need to we get we got to spot buy some more phantom because if this thing can push to three bucks easy, easy. It was over three dollars in the previous bull market, and then you got spooky swap. You can do uh, liquid basically like liquid staking with this with the boo token. You just like you stake boo to get x boo, and then you just hold x boo in your wallet, and then that you can um, exchange for boo tokens for the exchange rate of what you would get for liquidity. But yeah, Phantom's looking looking nice. Phantom's looking nice.
All right, guys. I'm, how long have we been streaming? How long have we been streaming? It's been like, it's been a, it's been a minute. It's been a minute. We've been streaming since twelve. We've been streaming since eleven forty-five, and it's one o'clock. So, <laughs> thank you guys so much for for being being with me this long. Let's. I gotta. I gotta like my own stream. All right. Thank you guys. Don't forget to go into the links in the description to support the channel directly if you want to support the channel. Um, I do have an NFT project, and if you are a Bitcoin fan, this is. Um, uh, this is a cool NFT project to get into. So, oh, what the, what in the hell? What in the, it's not working. Freaking open C. All right. So go to the website and just check it out on here. And it's called Ordinal Eyes. And it's these unique Bitcoin eyes. It's the eye of Satoshi. These are made by yours truly. And this is a way that you can also directly support the channel and just show people that you're super bullish on Bitcoin. And you can get these on the Polygon blockchain. You can use Matic. You can use USDC, uh, wrapped, uh, wrapped ETH on Matic. But these are, these are dope. These are my favorite ones, the first four. These are kind of like the first original four. Really, really cool, unique designs. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Heaven Peck. Heaven Peck's feeling really generous right now. He's like, hey, I made a bunch of money on Soul, so I'm <laughs> He's just gonna go to all the crypto live streams and 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 give everyone super stickers. <laughs> thanks, Heaven Peck. Blessings on to you. Blessings on to you. But yeah, if you go through here, you can go through and see that there's traits on here. <laughs> Like the Harry Potter, Sonic, Obama, Inu trait. You got the secret token. <laughs> I'm just trying to follow. What, what I'm trying to follow the chat. So we got a millionaire in the chat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretty much now. Yeah, we got a Solana. We got a Solana millionaire. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got this. This sits on the desk. This sits on the desk as the as the physical representation. And then you open the envelope and it says it will feel easy because it because it is your destiny. It will feel easy because it is your destiny. You got to have sometimes that Kanye level confidence to, to succeed. All right. So we might, we might pull a DJ day and start and start DJing. Candle cats actually, candle cats actually looking really bullish. Candle cats looking good. We need to actually look at. We actually went into Costco hot dog. We are actually trying to see how Costco hot dog would do, and so far it's not doing very well. But we did get airdropped cat with hat. Um, I don't know if that is anything that we would want to keep up with and act the the cat with hat. Let's see. Twenty five days ago was that? Is that the one? Is this the one? Liquidity nine twenty. Yeah. This might be the one. I don't know if this is it. Because sometimes you get airdrop things in your wallet and uh, you don't know if you want to interact with it or not. But yeah, we were getting into the cause. We got the Costco hot dog. <laughs> we got to go to the deck screener and then that'll give us a little bit more uh, deck screener. Been kind of liking deck screener a little bit more than dex tools. Kind of gives you the kind of gives you the sauce, just the things that you want to know. You want to know the volume. See candle cat. 
Candle Cat. All right, we might we might bust into Candle Cat. We might do that. We might see we might see how much Candle Cat. Cat with is going to be fire. I'm a meme guy and hate all other cat coins, but cat with hat breaks the model. It's better than with. Okay, so cat with hat. Is that the right cat with hat? OG blockchain saying congrats on 2K. Thank you guys. I love that you guys are just excited as I am on 2K. <laughs> I remember just like, gr I mean, you got to sometimes grind. YouTube is like, is unforgiving if you're in that below 1000 range or you only have like 400 or 500 subscribers. And that's usually the point where people give up. A lot of people will give up at 400 or 500 subscribers because you just, there's sometimes you just hit that wall and it's like, you have to battle through that. And you got to keep making the videos. You got to like, sometimes people like you only get like a, like 50 views on a video and you're like, why? Like, why? Like this, this video is awesome. It should have like a thousand views. And so you kind of just have to battle through those, those moments of just like, Ugh. and then, then YouTube finally gives you the bone, throws you the bone. Okay. Shark cat. I know I was hearing a lot about shark cat. And then Joe, uh, Joe Bowden is starting to get is, is coming back up. I know this one, this one, a couple uh, about, a, about a week or two ago um, came up and now it's getting getting some traction. So we'll see. Well, yeah, Candle Cat. Yeah, we're going to look at Candle Cat. All right. So let's actually just get the contract. Let's get the contract address. We got the pair candle. Let's copy that. And uh, let's see. Let me go here. And we are going to add this coin. I don't like the way that the Phantom Wallet does not let you add a token. It doesn't let you like add a token like you like you would on MetaMask, where you can just add the contract and just put it in your wallet. Um, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't add it aggregate it like metamask does i will say i don't like that all right so because if you want to let's see most of the pairs are happening the swaps are happening on we have what are most of them coming in on yeah i don't like it it said like that's the one thing i think phantom could do way better on is just the way that you can add tokens because it doesn't doesn't do it like on metamask you can add anything like if you have a contract address you can add it it'll say hey high risk make sure this is a token you trust and also metamask has aggregator uh network that will now pick the sources okay yeah let's do it on jupiter uh yeah that's what i normally do is i'll go on like orca jupiter radium or something like that so let's so let's check out jupiter let's go on jupiter and let me make sure i'm on the right jupiter dot is it jupiter dot ag swap is it that's the right address right for jupiter it's jupe dot ag right i just want to make sure It's, uh, let me just go to, I usually, if I want to make sure that I'm going to the right website, I just go to coin market cap and then I just pull it from there. So jupe. Okay. Yeah. Jupe.ag. Yeah. That is the right website. Okay. All right. So let's see if we can get, we can add this coin so we can see. Okay. Candle. Yep. We got it. Candle. We're going to add that confirm selection and then, yep. Cool. All right, so yeah, so we'll uh, we're gonna see we're gonna see what happens with Candle Cat. We're gonna go we're gonna go into Candle Cat. We're gonna see what happens because if we push up to seven cents, I mean that's a good that's a good that's a good three x right there. That's a good two x, or no, that's a three x. Be getting a clean three x. So we're gonna test out we're gonna test out Heaven Peck. Uh, uh, the soul journey, we're going to turn, we're going to turn one soul into 10 souls. So we're going to start with one soul. So we're going to pull some liquidity. We'll probably pull a little bit of liquidity from some of the trades and we will get one soul into the wallet and we're going to get on candle, candle cat, candle cat, and also cat with hat. And then we'll put a little bit more into Costco and we'll see what happens. All right, guys. 
thank you so much for being in this live stream. I think we're going to we're gonna go we're gonna go on a walk, get some sun. We gotta water the garden, and um, I have a cool pool to set up, and I want to get some water in it so my daughter can start swimming in this thing. So, thank you guys so much for for being in the live stream. This one was a lot of fun. I think we broke like all time records on on this stream today. We had a lot of interactions. We had a lot of crowd interaction, I, I want to say. <laughs> and um, uh, like all the likes, all the all the interaction is very much appreciated. And it just helps build this channel up. And uh, this community is what I'm wanting to build for everyone to come in and hang out, learn. We're on this journey together. And I don't want to feel like anyone can't ask a question or feel comfortable or feel like, you know, they're asking a dumb question. Like there's no dumb questions in crypto. There's so much in crypto that is sometimes hard to follow. And if you have a question, you don't know something or you feel like you're going to be made fun of because you don't know what this is or you don't know what that is. Don't even worry about it. People here are going to make you feel um, encouraged and they're not going to make you feel stupid. So I'll just say that. Thank you guys for being who you are and thank you for supporting the channel and thank you for helping me cross the, the threshold of that 2K level and we're going to just be off to the moon with this channel on to 30K. We're going to have 30K subscribers, you know, in, in, in the next, you know, couple weeks. That's where I see this channel going. So thank you so much and um, thank you. Um, oh, you're new to the channel. You tuned in late. Oh, no worries. But we'll, we stream every single day at 1130 and we go live at 11.30, and um, we go live at also sometimes 8 o'clock, but then mainly, yeah, we've been going live at 8 o'clock instead of 9 for the second stream of the day because then it just makes it easier to, to have more family time and all that stuff. And, yeah, you start getting in a little late, and it's like, woo. But when we start getting into bullish, bullish price action for Bitcoin, and we start getting into over 100,000, we might be just doing, you know, quick emergency late night streams and we just all hang out together. So that's going to be fun, guys. We're going to be getting into those times. So so thank you. Thank you so much again. Thank you to all the new people that have come on the stream. Thank you to um, all the OG people. I really do appreciate you guys. And I will see you uh, on the next stream. And we're just, uh, look, I'm just showing you guys. We actually, look, we crossed the level. We crossed the level. Just look, it's actually dumping right now. So I just want to show you guys that exactly as predicted, we're going straight into the level that we that was on the Bollinger Band. Because so now this could be the bounce. This could be the bounce. And let's see if that could be the bounce. I think that was the bounce. If we get another red candle crossing this level, then that will bring us down to lower prices where we start getting into 68.1 because we just wicked right down to this exact exact level that we just that we just said. All right guys, it's getting spicy. It's getting spicy. All right. Let's go. All right, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.